So, how big is this, huh? So, is this the, the, the dry kitchen? So, is this the bedroom? And I am back once again. This is Coach Alex. Welcome back, everybody, to the Prop Coach YouTube channel. So, as we get into the topic of the day, how many of you have already heard this statement? Real estate is a people business. Real estate is a people business. Real estate is a people business. And has it occurred to you? Why? We're talking about meeting all kinds of people. We're talking about how real estate is one of the most expensive assets in the world, right? Putting all these pieces together, what does that mean for you as a real estate agent? And why is it that real estate is a people business, right? Now, look at it, look at it. Take a step back, right? And then take a step back in again and take a step back, right? And look at it from a, just a slight distance what you might discover is that real estate is one product which requires you as the agent to spend actually a significant amount of time with your client be it a tenant be it a seller be it a buyer right to help them figure out what they need in order to help people figure out what they need what do you need to do you need to get to know them on a deeper level. But what is it that you're trying to help them to figure out? Real estate, right? They're talking about real estate, yeah, property. Yeah, okay, sure, right? But what do these people do with these properties? What do they do with this real estate? They live in it, right? You're talking about their lifestyle. You're talking about what they do on a day-to-day -day basis, right? Are they married? Are they single? Do they have kids or not, right? And all this information is essential for you to be able to close that deal and well, basically help them figure out what they need, you see? So that is why it is, right? Objectively speaking, like I said, take a step back and have a look at it. This is why it is a people business. It's about building relationships. Question to you now is, have you been building relationships? And then of course the following question is, if you say yes, okay, now my next question to you is, how are you building relationships? There are many, many studies that go around now in the world about the importance of social connections, right? And this is what makes real estate such a beautiful industry. Now, I'm gonna quote. There was a study done by a Mr. Robert Waldinger. He did a TED talk on what makes a great life. Now, you're probably wondering like, what in the world makes a great life? How is that related to real estate, right? Now, that's, a, that's exactly the beautiful thing about real estate. Now, what Robert found was this, right? Let me talk a little bit about the study. This was a study, right, done by Harvard over 75 years, and it's still ongoing till today. What were they doing? They were tracking, they were monitoring, studying the lives of a group of people, right from when they were young, in their teens, even earlier than that, right up till about now, hitting about the 80s and 90s, right? And you see what they found in short was that what makes a great life was actually the quality of relationships that they each had. If you're related back to the real estate, like whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute, wow, right? So think about it for a second. What does that mean for the real estate? What does that mean for you as an agent? Right? You spend easy 80% of your time right, building relationships. But what kind of relationships have you been building? Have you been being empowering, positive, fun ones, or have you just been doing high-buy kind of relationships? 
Now you see now, I'm coming from the angle now is real estate, yes, it gives you a good amount of money. Yes, it will help you change your lifestyle entirely, right, monetarily. But at the same time, it gives you that same ability to create what we call a fulfilling life. Everybody, that is what makes real estate so beautiful. Do you see it? We see it. Question is, do you see it? Food for thought. Everybody, it's Coach Alex, signing out.